one year when my mother had me go and spend my spring break traveling to Brunei to sell to the Sultan, who apparently had been refusing to accept visitors from, uh, or accept uh, visits from, from Van Cleef salespeople. My father, um, who was you know, working less and less and unable to travel, and, and so my mother wrote, uh, you know, sent a telegram to Brunei saying Mr. Arpels would like to come and visit. And, uh, and so, you know, they, they, they accepted, and of course it was the 17-year-old, like, 16-year-old <laughs> me showing up. And I remember traveling, uh, you know, going through customs with a, with, a, with a box that had like $20 million of jewelry, which in those days was a lot of money. I grew up knowing that I would always go into this business. Almost all of my experience is with the, is with the U.S. company. And for me, Van Cleef was always an extended family. Uh, I went there as a kid, looking at stones under the microscope and under ultraviolet lights, and we would cut the background out of pennies, solder them into little balls. And one story that really marked me was the was the first time in Paris that I went to see the um, in Paris in the in the workshop. We had one lapidary who specialized in um, cutting stones for the mysterious setting. And watching him work was just something I'd never seen before. This guy would, <clears throat> you know, when, when they cut a stone, they, they, they embed it in, you know, in a wax, um, you know, the end of a stick in, in wax. So, so he would hold up the, the stick with the stone on it and, uh, and he'd look at it for about a minute. I mean, a, I mean a minute, you know. Um, and then he would look at the design of the piece um, and then he would pick up the setting and he'd look at the setting for a minute and then he'd look at the stone again and then he'd give his wheel just a little push and he'd make the slightest cut um, and then go back to this process. He would do like three or four or five minutes of, of studying um, before making you know, the slightest cut which just lasted a second. You know the beauty of the of the mysterious setting is that every single stone is cut specifically to fit in one specific spot in you know in in one specific design. Van Cleef was never known for you know big big rocks. I mean that was more you know that wasn't so much Van Cleef style. Van Cleef was is really about about that that artistry and the craft and the and and the design.